What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Road 96. The last episode we had ended episode two in the game. I uh, had gotten arrested, unfortunately. I uh, hope we don't make that mistake again. And then we ran into Stan and Mitch, who forced us to help them steal everyone's money. Yay! And then we get to we got to run into the fabulous Sonia. <sighs> yeah, no. So anyway, let's find out who we uh, run into next, huh? And let's try to make it to the border with this person, shall we? Alright, so we have 558 miles till the border. Uh, but it really looks like we've cut off a whole lot of miles. Um, but we still have quite a ways to go. So yeah, let's find out who we meet next right now. Once again, it says hit, press any key. I hit enter and it's like, oh, I'm sorry, except for that one. I... So, oh my gosh, that's a lot of energy. <laughs> uh... Okay, walking in my shoes, I think that said. All right, so we're on the street and do 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 um it's dark out i'm a little nervous about who can to can you hear me <gasps> it's a bug messing with the connection <gasps> it's alex but don't worry prepubescent einstein here is gonna fix it yay he's okay i wasn't sure if those guys that we pranked got him or not there. so <gasps> help alex. me a sec, homie i got a bug i need to fix uh, sure, no problem. A bug? That? A bug? What's that? Help me in return. Hmm. Sure, Mr. no problem. Mr. isn't hearing me well. If I leave the booth, he'll hang up. I know it. Who are you talking to? Don't Who's sweat it, Mr. Mis you. It's just a hitchhiker. Mr. Er Mr. Er you? Mr. Okay. Oh, uh, what do I do? Who? Yeah, Mr. who is Ursus. that? He's a friend of mine. Okay. Take this computer. I oh. have a metal detector on it. Check the ground near the pole over there. I'm wondering if that's the guy he he was creating that gadget for in the last one that kind of looked a little bit like uh, something that can go boom. <laughs> but okay, cool, cool. I don't know why. Um. It's obviously, it's, it, like I said, it's obviously a computer, but I don't know why. It almost, it almost looks more like, um, except for with a bunch of keys instead of a second screen, but, uh, a DS. Ah. Okay. Should be some hidden keys to open the box and reboot the line. Pitcher okay. Pitcher and Calm hides their keys like a dog hides a bone. Wait, what? What am I doing? I'm so lost. I wasn't listening to... I wasn't exactly listening to what he said. Why weren't you listening? Why weren't you listening? Okay, anyway. Um... Ah! There it is. Okay. You find it yet? That I did. Uh, where did he say... Yeah. I get it. But... I need to find... Some keys. Let dig. Oh. You. Gotcha. Ah. Ooh. Okay, dig. Uh ooh, found money! What? Talk to me, dog. Let's find out what else we can find. Okay. I don't know why I'm so freaking confused. Where? Wait. I had it. There you are, sucker. More cans. You know, keep those. We could We're doing what we can, Mr. Yu. We can, uh, recycle them and... <gasps> oh! We got a tape! Yay! <gasps> I'm so excited to hear that one. Let the beeping guide you! This doesn't sound like beeping. It sounds like either purring or snoring. It sounds more like snoring. I ain't no dog. Anyway, well, where? 
I'm not hearing no beeps, dog. The key should be somewhere near the pole. <laughs> yeah, is this it? There it is. We found nice, it. Nice, really Thanks. All right. Thanks, dog. Does that you work? Hear me now? I do. Yeah. So, as Sweet. I was gonna say, Let's listen the in. fake emitters are all in place. Should keep those pigs busy for a while. Thanks, Alex. Uh, working for the brigades. Okay, so I can't. Apparently, I guess I can't say that. Uh, what are you talking about? I put up some fake radio emitters to help the brigades. Mm. <gasps> Wait a minute. Could he be actually talking to John? Because there are code names um, that he, he was using with um, oh, I forgot her name, but the uh, the cop. So could he be using a code name with him? Because I remember he that's the that had been the transmission in the back of his transmitter in the back of his truck. Ooh, who are the brigades? How's that help? How's that help them? They got an illegal radio broadcast. The fake emitters throw the cops off. I gotta run, Alex. Wait, wait, my parents. Sorry, kid. Now's not the time. We'll talk soon, okay? Promise. Don't hang Did up. Did that sound like John? Slice. Or is that just me? Again. Hello? <sighs> Too late. Oh. I'm sorry, bro. He's really trying to find out about his parents. Um, and if you don't remember, um, his parents uh, apparently died um, in that attack 10 years ago. And he had only just recently found out about it. Oh, Alex. I'm so sorry. But didn't that sound like, you know, John to you as well? Ah, there we go. Cool. Huh. Did you see that? What happened there to in the corner there? I wonder what that's about. Anyway. Are you okay? What happened? I'm fine. Just a little frustrated. Why are you frustrated? Why are you on the road? I'm looking for info on my bio parents. And they died when I was young. In the attack in 86. But I haven't come up with much. I'm sorry they died. Keep look, uh, Keep going. Don't give up. I don't know what you want to say. Both are good. Thanks. My mom, I mean my adoptive mom, said I might not find out anything, but I didn't believe her. Where's your adoptive mom? She knows you're on the road? She's at home. Or on the road doing her job. Come on. Let's wait out the rain in the booth. Oh, poor Alex. He's just trying to find out more information about his biological parents. Go ahead. No, you gonna wait for me? Oh. Okay. Maybe give your mom a call. Been a while since you talked. You two talked. I used to call her every week. But it's been a while, yeah. I see. You should call her. You really should, at least. Yeah, well, I guess you're right. <gasps> oh, yay, good. I was hoping that would happen. Precinct 22, Officer Fanny. Hello? Alex? Is that you? Yeah, it's me. Is everything okay? What do I say? Uh, just start talking. Say everything's fine. Well, 
just start talking, you know. I don't know if everything's fine. I mean, he's I mean, he's staying right in front of me, so obviously he's fine and safe. But I mean, you know, I don't know Everything's what's going fine. on with his life. I just wanted so. to well, check in. besides the whole parent thing. Are you getting enough to eat? You are, right? And you can come back whenever you want. You know that. Uh, say that you're eating enough. You're not ready to come back. Um, I'm just gonna say that that's up to him if to decide that or not. I'm not gonna tell him to tell her that. I mean, if he's ready, if he feels ready to come back, he's ready to come back. Um, honestly, I don't know. I want him to find out what happens to his parents, but at the same time, I feel like he should go back. But at the same time, he, he has every right, and I want him to find out what happened to, and you know, exactly what happened, you know, who exactly his biological parents were, and, you know. And I think when we first met him, he, I think he said, he may have said something that made it almost sound like he thought maybe they're actually still alive, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm getting enough to eat. Thanks. I... I hope you find what you're looking for. I miss you, Alex. Tell her you miss her too. Ask how she is doing. Don't tell her you miss her. Oh, come on! I'm pretty sure Alex loves her. Because she's taking care of her. Or taking care of him, sorry. Basically all his life. Unless... This situation really did change his mind, but he called her. But it would also be nice for him to ask how she's doing, too. And how are you? Oh, hang it in there. You know me. Look, I should go. Oh, already? Say that you'll call again soon. Remind her not to look for you. I'll call again soon. I promise. I love you. Bye. And you better. Bye, baby. Because it sounds like she's, she's even though she wants you to come back, it sounds come like on. she's pretty cool it's with you doing what you feel like you need to do. So you I better, better now. actually call her Thanks again. Thanks for encouraging me to call. Oh, see, he feels better too. Glad I could help. You're welcome. Any tip on how to survive on the road? Yeah. Be careful with what you eat. Try to avoid rotting food. But, you know, beggars can't always be choosers and all that. Alright. Uh, yeah, whatever it takes to cross. If Floris wins, we'll eat better. A rot rotten, rotten food can fuel a revolution. Um. Let's go... I guess with this one. Real bad. I can tell. I still have a few things to clean up around here. By the way, there's a cereal bar in my bag if you want. <gasps> oh, yay! Thank oh, you! And I yes. I can you a taxi, too. I hacked into Happy Taxi, because I can, and got some free ride vouchers. <laughs> nice. Well, um, first of all, it would save on my energy, and my energy will what really went down and I kind of want to see Jordan again even though he was kind of crazy um at the same time I want to find out more about him and what happened because it sounds like he lost a really close loved one in uh that attack 10 years ago so I kind of want to find out more about that so I'll say that it's as good as done and good luck on your journey man hope you reach 96 thanks can I get the candy bar first Oh, ooh, nice. Filled up too. Oh, appreciate it. Same to you. Okay, I'm glad I went to get the candy bar first. <laughs> okay, okay. Hello. How's it going? Don't kill me. Ooh, I'm hoping- Ah, I was hoping it would get below 500. Almost, though. Almost. So, we have 504 miles left to go. So, let's find out if it is Jared who we meet next. That it is. 
Enjoy the silence. Why? Um, what can we look at? Um. Uh, hello! I'm guessing that, 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 uh, nice classical music helps keep you calm. You could turn it up as loud as you would like and as, and listen to it as long as you want. Don't bother me none. Sup? How's it going? Sorry. Forgot you were back there. Uh, are we so still going the direction I need to go? With Abby Taxi. Oh, okay. Uh, just north. Don't know yet. Uh, to the border. Um, we're gonna then say that. Just north it is. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Uh, I mean, I no, I don't want to rest. No. I don't want to fall asleep. No! I don't want- No! 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 I'm gonna keep my eyes on you! He's whistling with cigarette in his mouth. Okay. Alright. Um. Okay. Let's go to sleep. A little nervous of what's gonna happen. I don't see there to be a reason for him to want to hurt me, but, uh, okay. Oh, hello. Yes, I'm awake now. What is all this? Yeah, what is all this? What is... All that belonged to the last customer. I'm sorry for the mess. Um... Sketches of an explosive device... Cause that'll- That- that might be what Alex was working on. So either that- Either that was his stuff? I don't think that was his stuff. I bet you that was the guy that he was work- he's working for. Or the, someone he's working for or working with to build that device. He left that behind too. Okay, so yeah, that's not Alex. That's someone else. I'm sorry about that. It's a lot of... S it's a little strange. I can see why you would say that. This person forgot many things. Not a lot gets by you, I can tell. <laughs> well, you know, way, snappy I'm detective. Is the truth. We're called Happy Taxi. But we could be called Honest Taxi, too. Yeah, no, I don't believe you. You're definitely in on Maybe it. But at the same time... Maybe you have some questions about the road. I can help you with those. Yeah, like, uh, can you keep your eyes on it? Uh, take many teens to the border. Know anything about, uh, karma? Any thoughts on the cops? Hmm. I guess that's a no. I see. Interesting. Uh, lean for. Why do I want to lean forward? Hello. <gasps> oh, cold anger. Okay. Um, what's that? Handcuffs? Oh no, no. What's on the radio? You shouldn't be this close to me. That's not for your eyes. Um. Yep, no, we're just going now back. Sit back and stay seated. Okay. Enjoy your ride with okay. Happy Taxi. It went down. Way down. That's good. That's good. That's good. I was just getting a little too scared. That's good. He had cane cuffs and everything. Uh. 
You hear something? Yeah, you seriously hear something? What was no. that? I heard something. Do you have someone in the truck? You heard that right? Sorry. I didn't. I'm going to turn the music up now. <gasps> oh! Do you like dinosaurs? Uh, yeah. Uh, something weird is- I'm keeping silent. Did you say something? It wasn't me. No, I don't. Uh, that was my stomach. Oh. I see. Bro. He kidnapped that guy that was in here. That makes sense. Oh, it all makes sense. Cause he's planning a- Oh, he's probably part of the brigades and he would be against the brigades because someone he loved died in that attack. You know what? I'll get out here. Never mind, nothing. Oh. Oh. Um. Because he might, he may, not, he's probably not going to stop. Oh no. I think I have a flat tire. Better take a look. Sit tight. Okay. okay. I thought he locked. I thought. Oh shoot! He's gonna kill me! Oh, oh dear lord! No. <laughs> you don't want to die! No, no, please! What did I say about disturbing the customer? No, I didn't want to flee! Cleverness. I wanted to try to help the dude. But at the same time, I'm just a teenager. What am I supposed to do? But I unlocked oh, cleverness. Look at that. Impressive. 